thought it was safe. What are you doing here? He's back. Are you going to turn me in? Todd returns. Don't tell anybody I said this, but I want to come home. I got some unfinished business with people. And Landview will never be the same. You're not going to get my help, not even if my life depended on it. Well, what if your kids' life depended on it? What? Max. Max is here. What? Hey, Blair's going to get him on you before you go on. Max, wait! <laughs> Just you now. Where's Taya? You don't need to go. What'd you do to her, Todd? I cut her up in little pieces and I keep her in my freezer. Well, maybe. What are you gonna do to me? Hurt me? That I would hurt you. Excuse me, but you just clobbered Max here. I was trying. You had trouble keeping him out of the club. Seems like your famous seduction routine has lost its punch. I was trying to help you out. Claude, I killed him. Oh, relax. I didn't hit him hard enough to kill him. Well, you just had brain surgery last year. Really? They put one in? No, you're lucky he's still breathing. I just hope he comes out of this in his right mind. How would you be able to tell? Oh, Claude, it's not funny. I was being a Samaritan. Supposed to believe that you did all this as a favor to me? Yeah. You're Blair. You're... You're the mother of my child, who you should be home with now, taking care of instead of parading around. Oh, I'm going to do disappearing from her life. Okay, I'll talk to you. Soon. Oh, wait, wait, Todd, wait. Okay, okay, okay. If you're serious about saying that you want to help me. You can help me keep Max out of the club because I don't want him to see Jessica. How come you don't want Max near Jessica? Because Max and Asa have it in for Jessica's boyfriend, Will Rappaport, and Jessica and Christian Vega are helping Will because they're all on the run from the cops. You kidding? Anything to do with this? No, I, Max would turn him in, Todd. Well, that's what you get for marrying if you can. Would you just stop it a minute? Just help me, please. Help me get Max in a cab. I'll make up some story for what happened to Max, please. I'll leave well enough alone. Oh, you call this leaving well enough alone? Jessica's gonna sing, and I don't want to miss that. God! God! <laughs> You guys were so awesome. Will you sign my flyer? Hello, Jessica. So you found me. What do you want? Why well, you sing nice? Thought maybe I'd pick up a CD. Are you going to turn me in? Turn you in for what? Don't joke with me. I know that's why you're here. Isn't it? Up on the stage singing. Wow. Our baby Jessica's all grown up. You're on the lam. You're with Sam's son. 
I bet Ace is going to commit Harry Carey when he finds out. Well, Ace is the reason that we're on the run. He set up Will, and we can't go home until we prove that. So you're going to take on the almighty powerful Ace? Huh? I'm very impressed. Dad, are you going to turn me in? No. Hey, you want to take on the Alpha Buchanan? You have my blessing. Bet Vicky's got Ajita, though. You running away like that? She understands. Well, she must be a little worried. She's a lot more to worry about than me. Well, like what? Nothing. Well, must be something. No, you can tell me. Nothing. It's nothing. My mom's fine. Oh, you're a terrible liar. Look, if it has to do with Vicky, then I'm going to find out with or without you. And I may be a lousy brother, but I am her brother. I, I'd like to know. Maybe I can help her. My mother has breast cancer. She has a great team of people. Everybody's really positive, you know? But not you. You're not there with her. No, I'm not. But the rest of the family is. Todd, if she was in my position, I know she'd be doing the exact same thing I'm doing. Fine. You do what you need to do, but I'm going to go see if I can't do anything there. What are you talking about? 